大家好，我是左叔。蝙蝠侠第四因为老钱的一次无心之举，叶师傅不仅是遭遇到生涯的首次 KO， 同时还要面临六十天的医疗禁赛期。但好在赛后恢复期间，托尼老师的心态还是不错的。Getting knocked out and adding that to the resume, I feel actually not too bad. Got knocked the fuck out. I don't ever want that shit to happen again. Yeah, I mean, there's only so much humility man can obviously go through. I mean, I've been through it all, right? I mean, I've had my belt stripped. I mean, I've had a lot of, you know, I don't have to go back and refurbish so much stuff. But going back and looking at it, the first round, I didn't do too bad. And I was having fun in there. I had a great fight week. I started loosening up more towards towards the fight, which was fun. And I pray to God every day that I walked out of that that cage, coherent or not coherent, but I was able to wake up. Because I didn't remember standing on the stool. I don't remember barely second round. I don't remember talking to Chuck Liddell, and I don't remember walking out and seeing the fans. All I remember was looking at my coach. Lights kind of went on and a fade, like a fade in, like a like a movie director, like a fade in. And I look at my coach, and I'm walking to the ambulance, and I said, "Fuck! I already knew it. I lost." 四场连败之后，三十八岁的夜魔关于未来何去何从，似乎又有了新的想法。首先是关于团队以及训练场馆的问题。长期以来，叶师傅在很多人眼中都是属于那种特立独行的存在，缺乏科学的训练方法，导致长期伤病累积。这也是叶师傅相比于同龄选手状态下降的特别快的原因。不过好在叶师傅已经意识到这个问题，考虑加入到训练拳馆，以及需要一个更好的教练和陪练团队，回归科学的训练方法。As you're listening to your corner, and it's very important that you have a really good relationship with them, so that way they're not sending you into battle. You know, I'm not going to shy away from it. I've had、uh, Pitmaster reach out to me that I had to be able to open myself up again and to to accept being coached at a high level, man, especially in my sport. 其次是量级问题。在被钱德勒 KO 之后，叶师傅开始考虑更现实的问题：是不是应该离开这帮如狼似虎的轻量级，回到2011年 TUF 出道时的次重量级？毕竟长期不科学的训练以及极限减重带来的状态下滑，已经在最近的四场比赛表现得越来越明显。Too hard, but I lose a lot of muscle mass, man. I fucking hate being skinny like that. I look like a little bitch. Fucking don't like that. When I'm ready to fight, I will let the UFC know, and I guarantee you, they'll let me know too. That hey, this is who we have. 